So this is a video to demonstrate how to read your vehicle with MPPS version 13. The purpose of this video is for uh, BMW M57 and M47 engines. Now the cable is the clear one. It looks like a K plus decan cable but it's not. It's MPPS version 13. Now to, for the software to load this page up you need it plugged in to your car otherwise it'll come up with a little box and it it just won't show this so first you select your car bmw 3 series and mine happens to be uh, 2 litre bosch edc 16 c35 now to check your connection is good you click on ecu id which will show up your vehicle software hardware numbers up there so now what we do is we do read and then the progress will start down at the bottom there so we got one percent right so we're almost complete now so my read was less than five minutes you can see the time it varies per vehicle sometimes it could be one sometimes it can be five sometimes 20 minutes and sometimes uh, 25 right so saving that uh, if you're from the UK, I'd use your Reg, something like the YT21, TZM, or if you're not in the UK, the last seven digits of your VIN, because this is good to identify the vehicle if anything needs to be done in the future. So yeah, all you do then is save, and then it says switch off ignition to continue. Um, you don't have to do that and then you just wait and then it's done now the re the write process is very similar um, sometimes the time for read and the time for write can be the same and can be different but um, it depends it depends on, on the vehicle really because they're all different now you don't need to put stable voltage to read the um, vehicle but you need stable voltage to write the map because obviously you don't want to be halfway through writing it and then it, it just dies on you so when you write into the ECU you want to have either a battery charger connected to the car or you in worst case scenario you can have jump leads connected to another car which is running but yours is not running so that will keep your voltage stable um, also with your laptop you're going to need to make sure that's got enough power or best thing to do is have it plugged in because then you know it's not going to die on you but yeah if you just follow these simple instructions then it's easy to read and write with this program and MPPS cable is fairly cheap on eBay there's, there's loads of them on there and the software is included but if it's not included I could probably send you the software or you could probably find it online for download this would work probably on MPPS version 18 or newer as well but um, this one is the bare minimum version 13 that you need so why why buy the other one unless 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 you want to pay more money finally this is the cable MPPS version 13 it's like a clear cable which is the same color cable as um, K plus decan cables but K plus decan can also be blue as well